Alright, Team UDF here with more Parallel Worlds. Christmas, not really Christmas marathon. Today we're going to be playing with, uh, the stuff that we got, like the Goron bracelet and the magic hammer, mainly. And now we can finally get this piece of heart. Let's go on in here and see if there's anything inside. Um, doesn't look like it. I don't think so. Alright. Uh, you know what, actually... Hold on a minute, I want to try something. Aha! Okay, do you remember what Zelda said about pushing the shoulder buttons and stuff? Well, if you do that, you can reveal hidden passages. And now we found the Book of Medora. The Book of Medora. The Book of Medora? The Book of Medora, come on, there we go. Alright. You... Hold on. Someone wants something. Okay, anyway, you found the Book of Medora. Not only can it translate ancient text, but it has an added functionality in this game. Using this item in the dungeons will teleport you back to the entrance. Ah, uh, so this has the magic mirror power in this game, I guess. Yep, just hold the shoulder and A buttons and, uh, you can reveal hidden passages. Well, I guess you can't do it outside. That makes sense. Anyway, let's go ahead and... Actually, let's see what's over here now that we've managed to... Ooh! Uh, Alright, let's see what's in here. Alright. Oh, this is... Oh, this is where we got that first piece of heart in the very first video. Okay. Well, I guess there wasn't anything down here yet. Well, I don't know. This video will probably just be exploration and, and stuff. Now that we can go more places, since we have the Goron Bracelet and the Magic Hammer, We'll be using it to access places we couldn't previously get to before. And, uh, uh oh, I don't want to talk to her. Anyway. So let's see if we can find anything good. Here's something, we can dash charge that. Nah. No. Oh well. Although that, that has just reminded me of the first place I want to go. We're gonna go back to the guardhouse. Because now we can... go to that one room because we have the hammer. And we can dash charge those uh, rocks on the outside. Ooh, let's see if we can catch this guy. Uh, maybe next time. Oh well. Merchant's way it is. Let's go, Link, on an adventure to places we've already been. But yeah, since I'm going for as close to 100% as possible, you know. Might as oh, this isn't the guardhouse. Might as well, you know, get as much of this out of the way as possible. So that we can just do stuff later on in the game without having to worry about backtracking and item collection and whatnot. Might as well just get all that out of the way in the beginning, right? Because then we go into the dark world and stuff more prepared. Ha, we outran his bullet. And here we are at the guardhouse. Alright, we can dash charge that now. Yay! Ooh, and the piece of heart. So that's three pieces of heart for us. I've already found two in this video. Let's see if we can find that fourth and complete the heart container. Go away. I guess he's not chasing us. Hooray! Alright, we won't be in here for too long. I just wanted to check what this gives us over here. Yeah, it's been a while since we've been here, huh? You remember me having to go through here using only pots and freaking bombs? Alright, and that's as easy as that. Now we can go over here, and we get a treasure chest right off the bat. Go away. Oh, I wanted to charge attack. Darn it. I beat Moldorm and I get my ass handed to me by a freaking guard. And we got the big... Wait a minute. I thought we already had the big chest key. Because we got the boomerang. Maybe that was only for the sewer. Oh, whatever. Let's go down here. And we get... Um, what do we get? Oh, we get Hyrule Castle. Okay. That's weird. Uh, I guess there's nowhere to go over here. What's this? Nothing. Let's sort of this guy. Haha. -ha. And oh, we can't go this way yet. Oh. Oh well. I guess there's nothing to do here. So back in the guardhouse we go. Oh, I know where I know where we can use this big chest key. It's in uh, the area that's on this floor. So maybe there is something here for us. 
Well, you know, I can't resist treasure, so we're gonna have to go get it now. This is part of the 100% completion, though, so it's not really a waste of time, I guess. See, right through that door. And then a few rooms beyond, and there should be another big chest waiting for us. Because I think there was one on this floor that we couldn't get to. So let's go through here, ignore that guy. And... nope, no hidden passages here. Although that wall is still suspicious, I might bomb that before I go. There it is. Let's get this treasure chest. Go away, guard. Hooray! And we get... The mushroom. This mushroom smells like rotten fruit. What's it doing here, anyway? I don't know, game. You tell me. You tell me what it's doing here. Well, we found the witch in the potion shop. Maybe we can use that already. Alright, let's bomb this. Let's see if anything's inside. So we have the bombs to spare now. No, it's just a red herring. Stupid thing. Oh, well. Alright, well, we're done with the guardhouse again. And I don't think we'll have to come back here at all, ever, again. Although I'm still suspicious on what this is. There's still something to do here. But maybe we get that entrance in the future or something, I don't know. The structure of this place doesn't make sense. I mean, the guardhouse is right here. We go two... Like, two rooms beyond there, and we're in Hyrule Castle. But Hyrule Castle's off to the far left, so I don't get that. Whatever. It's a ROM hack, I won't complain too much about the structure and stuff. Lake Saria. Do we have anything to do- Oh, well, we can fall in the water, like a complete idiot. Uh, there's a rock over there, Let's, we might as well move it. Oh, there's a bomb there. No, there's nothing here. Oh well. Let's see, what other secrets can we get? Pretty sure. I know there's a couple hammer caves we can still go to. And to progress with the story, we probably have to go back to the docks again. And tell them that we got the jewel from the cemetery. Whoa. Alright, back in Kakariko once again. I wonder if the chickens swarm on you if you hit them enough. I don't think so. Ooh. Let's see what's under here. Uh, <laughs> nothing. Okay. Well, we'll find a secret one way or the other. Let's go ahead and swipe some hearts, though, from this guy. Just to be safe. And then, let's see, this nothing. Is there any more? I just want to make sure we get them all. I guess I missed something. Well, we could... We might as well get our fortune told now. I skipped that the other time, but let's do it now. Yep, you have an interesting destiny. He'll make it cheap, even though it's probably like a hundred rupees. What will he tell us? Abracadabra, Alakazam, the true hero will find the Master Sword in the ancient ruins. Fifteen rupees. Okay, well that's not that bad. Oh, he healed us too. So I guess we didn't need to swipe the hearts from that kid. Oh well. You know, I know what we can do. We can, um... Here we go. I knew there was one over here somewhere. <laughs> There's nothing under it. Darn it. Oh, you stupid crow. Go away. There better be something good here. There's nothing here. Ooh, a heart. Oh, I went behind the tree. Oh, that sucks. Oh, well. Huh? Huh. Uh... Anyway, like I was saying earlier, I know what we can do. Remember that Armo site at the very beginning of the game we couldn't beat? Let's go ahead and try to go beat that. Uh, we're running out of time quickly, though, so we have to do it fast. Go, Link! Run! Let us defeat the Armos Knight and see what we get. It was just the one Armos Knight that we had to get past in order to get the lamp, I think it was. 
So let's see if we get anything for beating it. We can pass that now, but that thing shoots us. Alright, let's get him. Ow. Oh, the boomerang. Haha. I think it's 12 hits. 10, 11, 12. Yeah, okay. Uh, no, we don't get anything. Darn it. I predicted that too, didn't I? Oh, well. Way back in the first video, I said we probably wouldn't get anything if we beat it. Oh, well. Well, we got two pieces of heart this episode, and we got some money, and we got our fortune told. We learned something about the Master Sword. So next episode, we'll go back to the docks and pick up some more secret stuff, hopefully. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you for the next episode.